Twelve weeks after President Muhammad Buhari received his first jab of the Oxford AstraZeneca COVID-19 vaccine, the nurses return this time to his residence to administer his second dose. Dressed in white, the president, who appears quite relaxed, receives the jab before a much smaller audience. Like the first, the vaccine is administered to him by his personal physician, Dr. Rafin Dadi Sanusi. I see this is mine. Thank you very much. Bio. Well, trying to be informed, we are not being badly in Nigeria. Uh, relative to even more developed countries. Look at uh, the casualties in India, Brazil, United States, and so on. So I congratulate you, the medical teams across the society. Um, I think you have been able to handle the situation. And uh, I hope uh, we'll be economically uh, disposed to give most of Nigerians, the vaccination when it is available. Meanwhile, the Presidential Steering Committee on COVID-19 is confident about the arrival of more vaccines into the country. It's only a question of when it will be because vaccine manufacturers now are under pressure to deliver to those countries who are really suffering. Uh, so we are working with uh, in bilateral uh, conversations with other manufacturers in South Africa where latest by August we hope to get uh, Johnson & Johnson vaccines and then bilateral uh, uh, conversation with countries who should be ready to give us surpluses of what they have so that we can continue our vaccination program. The longer we delay, the longer uh, we wait uh, without vaccinations, uh, then the higher the risks that uh, we might uh, import uh, strains uh, that might uh, uh, be difficult to control. According to the National Primary Health Care Development Agency, nearly 2 million doses have been administered across the country. This is part of plans to inoculate 70% of Nigerians by 2022. From the presidential villa, Gloria Umezuke, Channels Television News.